it's winking. It's winking <laughs> an eye. It's mantis. Poor mantis. Well, ladies and gentlemen, there has been a seismic shift in the robot fighting world. It's all okay. I just dropped the hot glue gun. <laughs> so, for the first time in 20 years, a rookie has won the Robo Games heavyweight division. Not only that, it's the youngest, youngest competitor that has ever taken home the gold medal heavyweight championship. Go, Nick! <laughs> so, I've seen Nick for a long time. He came up through the ant weight circuit. Junior ant weight circuit. And, and then an adult. They, yeah. And tsunami. Um, for those of you who don't know, uh, all the great BattleBot builders got their start at Robo Games. Where did Tombstone get a start? Robo Games. Where did Minotaur get a start? Robo Games. Where did the Vasquez brothers with Whiplash get their start? Robo Games. Where did Black Dragon get a start? Robo Games. Where did Free Shipping get a start? It made a legend. Robo Games. Where did Gigabyte get a start? You might sense a pattern here. Just about every great builder has been in the heavyweight contest, and a lot of them have gone home with the heavyweight gold. So, let's take a look if this new rookie has what it takes to go home with the giant nut next season. Yeah, he's famous for that because he has the racing car background. We see that weapon of man. Oh, Ooh. big hit right away. Oh, there is that weapon from Manta. Quite emulate what this sounds like in person. Low to the ground, creating some sparks. Ooh, big hit. Jeez. Manta just going after the back wheels. Banana Runt just at the mercy here of Manta. Ooh, we've got Big pieces coming off there. Yeah, Banana Run's driving fine. We have just, pieces hitting the ceiling. I mean, the size of some of those chunks that he's tearing off. Okay, that looks like it. And your winner by knockout, Manta. What a beautiful wow. showing. Let's hear wow. it for Manta. Tell us what happened. That was so exciting. That was our first fight ever. And ever. We, we've been building this robot for months and I've just worked so hard on it and do the thing and like destroy a robot completely. It's just amazing. Like I couldn't be more happy right now. So we're here with the hit robot of the weekend, Manta and Nick of Team Tanto. Nick, so this is your new robot? Yeah, brand new. We had its first fight and this, it went pretty well. This is a heavyweight, 250 yep. pound drum spinner? Yeah. 20 inches wide, the drum weighs 70 pounds, and it spins up to 250 miles an hour. Jesus! Yeah. Going on in, real hard hits. That weapon is something to be feared, and it's got the front lip bent up on Stink Eye there, so it's probably not going to be. Oh, he chews up a wheel! If Manta can get that other wheel, this is over. Well, Ray's, Ray's weapon's still spinning, so this is not a, got a ways to go yet. But we're tag-teaming with the wall, takes the well, oh my god! Hits that wheel, double jumps it. Six, five, oh. more hits. Ray Billings requested an extra hit. What First thing I notice, obviously, besides the big honking weapon, is just... How well engineered everything is inside this. I mean, a very symmetrical robot looks like. Right down, the, right down the center. What materials are you using? So everything that's steel is AR500, sun-kissed sand, welded. Um, and then the main frame rail is a 651 aluminum machine. And it has an integrated gear box on right here. And now it spits out chains to the wheels. And I've got two motors on everything. So very redundant drivetrain, very redundant weapon system, it looks like. Two brushless motors. Supposed to just keeping its face forward. The forks have been torn off of Terror Tops. 
So you're gonna enter BattleBots this upcoming year? Hopefully, yeah, yeah. Everyone bug BattleBots, so uh, get hands on. I'll happily, happily go on BattleBots. Yeah, if you're in the chat, please <laughs> like and say we want Manta for season eight <laughs> yes. BattleBots. I can't wait to catch more of your fights this weekend. I've seen uh, exactly what happened to Big Dill. Looks like Big Dill is completely retired. <laughs> This thing's awesome. I can't wait to get back to check it out. Mantha spins up immediately. White Rabbit off kilter. And Manta following up, getting some big shots in there. That is a that is a destructive bot. Oh my god! So, That's a spicy meatball. That is a spicy meatball. That is a drum that is leaving a wake of destruction in its path. Mm -hmm, as Manta mm -hmm. took out one seasoned BattleBot veteran after another. And I pose this question to you, BuilderBlog. Do you think he's going to win World Championship 8? Hmm. I know everyone's still talking about World Championship 7. And we're going to have the finale here in the next few days. But... There's a new rookie on the horizon. Do you think he's going home with rookie of the year that year? Or and you... the nut? <laughs> or just the nut? So I want to hear from you. What do you think? So I hope everybody enjoyed this look at a future competitor at BattleBots. Who? And uh, by the way, Greg and Trey, if you, Put if him you on. skip him again, you're Put him crazy. On. Put him on. <laughs> <laughs> All right, everybody. I hope you enjoyed the video. We're going to have a check-in on Project Extinction next week. So please mm. like and subscribe. And come back to see what craziness we're up to. See ya.